Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now today's video is something a little bit different for me. So this is going to be a second hand designer haul. Now I visited Encore which is in Sirencester. Now if you've never heard of Sirencester, I don't blame you, I used to live there. It's like a little town, y you can't find it, trust me. It's tiny. Anyway, Encore is a second-hand designer store which sells some rather fabulous pieces and allows you to get the designer look for less. So I have four pieces here which came to a grand total of around £200, which obviously is a little bit more expensive but incredibly good quality and we have some rather amazing brands in there. So. With that said, let's show you the goodies I picked up. So first up, we have this absolutely adorable dress, which I think just looks like a pixie. I absolutely love it. I plan on living in this this summer and it's beautiful. It's got these sort of cape sleeves and then this embellished belt. And this pattern is just adorable. And I mean, I'm probably not gonna know half the designer's names, but it's Tinzanzo Mazzalini. Yeah, not gonna say that I pronounced that correctly, but this was absolutely beautiful and I just adore it. It's such good quality. Buying a secondhand designer is these pieces could have been roaming around for years and you may never be able to find them again. So, that means you won't be turning up at that party in the same outfit as somebody else unless you're really, really unlucky. Am I the only one dying over this dress? This is probably gonna be my favourite summer piece, I'm not gonna lie. It is so beautiful, the quality, the pattern, oh, I love it! I have had it taken a little bit up so that it isn't too long, but can I just live in this dress forever. Da, da, da. So next we have this piece. Now if I recall correctly, this piece was quite a bit cheaper. I think it was like 25 pounds. And that's because this one is a Tommy Hilfiger. So that is not as much of a pricey brand. It's just this sort of camel colored knit with, oh, oh, it's all tangled up. What have I done? I'm so confused. So yes, it's this knitted dress with this beautiful applique embroidery-ness attached. And this is a medium, so it is a little bit big, but it does have this little drawstring waist belt with these little wooden balls on the end, which just add to the whole cute factor. And if you tie it at the waist, it still looks fabulous and I love it. Here is the Tommy Hilfiger knit. And I mean, I just feel like a Summer by the Hamptons sort of girl right now. I think this is so effortless and just easy to chuck on over a bikini or wear in the evening. You could either make this really indie with like tassels and feathers or you could make it very chic with leather and sandals. Next and up we have this bad boy. Now this is rather electric and I personally love electric midnighty blue shade I think it is flattering on every skin tone and it's just such a classy color so this is from Pepper which I can't say I've ever heard of but to be fair I don't really care what designer it is as long as it looks nice I am happy so this is an off-the-shoulder dress top thing it's probably a top but you know I'm gonna wear it as a dress anyway and then it's got these adorable pockets and it's just a very light I don't know if it's silk is there a label in here telling me what the fabric is I hope it's blooming silk okay we shall never know but I mean it feels like silk to me this did have a line of pink lace at the bottom but I wasn't the biggest fan so I did get my dressmaker to give it a little bit of a cut and it's just such a beautiful fabric that looks so expensive. But because it's second hand, it really wasn't too bad. I say too bad, wasn't too bad. Still wasn't amazing, but wasn't too bad. Here is the beautiful bright blue off the shoulder dress. Now, I know this is quite short, but I think it looks so classy and I absolutely adore it. It has pockets, so it's a winner for me because I love a dress with pockets. 
sets. Finally, we have this piece. Now, no doubt, this is gonna look like a hot mess when I'm holding it, but this is an absolutely beautiful Michael Kors blouse. Now, this is just what dreams are made of. I think this piece is so Lydia Elise Millen, and, well, I'm obsessed with her, as we know, and I just absolutely adore it. It is see-through, so you will need to wear something underneath it. But I can imagine this paired with some little white denim shorts. And it's just such an effortless, stylish piece that I think will always be on trend. That is a good thing with these pieces. I don't feel that they are on trend or out of trend. They are just timeless classic pieces that you will wear always and get the cost per wear out of them. So... Yeah, I think it's this or the dress that's my favourite piece just because it's so classy and effortless and beachy and I love it. Now we have this fabulous Michael Kors shirt and yes, it is a tad big for me, but do I care? No, and me and my mum will be sharing everything anyway, so it's fine. I just think this is such a timeless piece and these sleeves are just my life. Like, can I be these sleeves? please. So this has been my second hand designer haul. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Please give it a like and subscribe to my channel and I will see you all next time. Bye. You should subscribe and you should watch this video.